Welcome back to another YouTube video. This does not look good for Bitcoin. This is really bad. So as you can see, we had this massive drop to the downside. We tried to recover, came back down with a double top, formed a double, to double sorry, a double bottom, which is extremely bullish in the short term. We tried to get back up, and as you can see, bull trap, and we're falling back down. This is an extremely bearish pattern for Bitcoin. I'll show you why just right now. Let's get rid of all these on the actual chart to make it look nice and fresh for you guys. Get rid of this, get rid of this, and get rid of this. Okay, so if you've been tuning into the channel, first of all, I want to say a big thank you to you guys. Make sure you like, comment, like coin for a chance to win $10 every single Sunday. And just want to say a big thank you for you guys being here. If you guys have been tuning in, you can see, and I, you would know that these are the limits where you buy, you sell here, and you buy again here or sell here. Or you can sell here and ride it down to the bottom and have you take profit at the bottom ones. You basically buy and sell on these red lines and they always work. As you can see here, here, and we rode them up here to here to here to here to here. They always work. Always, always, always work. So saying that, I said to you guys yesterday, if you do are looking for a trade, make sure you look into for when it rebounds off here. It'll probably get a wick lower and then you can rebound upwards, okay? And I even put an entry for trades on um, over here for our Patreon. And I have been showing you guys proof of that in the start of every single video. I haven't done this one because of how urgent it is that you guys see actually how fast Bitcoin's moving down. As you can see, yesterday we fell all the way down to here, okay? And it was looking a bit strange, but then we spent a good, a good 12 hours um, trying to build up momentum here. That price moved very, very slowly. Their volume was really slow. As you can see, they're all one-hour candles. These are all one-hour candles, these small green ones, okay? And look how slowly it moved up, and then randomly we had a big jump. The EMAs were about to cross here, and unfortunately, if I go into the hourly, can hourly candles, just to show you how slow price is moving then. Like, look, you can see how, like, how it was over here. Let's get the brush up. You can see over here. Price didn't know what to do around this area. It did not know. It was just climbing very slowly, very inconsistent. And then randomly, we had this big jump to the upside, retested the EMAs, and we went. Okay. And look, this is a very small head and shoulders that, that was formed. We broke it. If we get a retest, go short. That's what we're, we're already in a trade right now, ever since we touched this top line. And I expect all of you guys to be in these trades as well. Because I tell you guys all the time, you buy or sell on these red lines. And what do we do? Oops, sorry about that, guys. What do we do? We smashed this red line twice, and now we're falling. Okay, so we're in a huge profit because usually your stop loss would you'll take your you enter a trade here, your take profit and would be um, like here, and your stop loss would be an equal amount because like traders aren't sure with their stop loss, but our stop loss is right here. So look at that. You're risking 1% to gain 5%. That's a 5x on your money. That's how good traders trade. And that's how we trade. So like the trade from here, we stopped, we had a really tight stop loss at about 54, 500. And we took the profit here. That's a 1 to 2x. As you can see, it's double. Yeah, the, the distance from here to here Rather than here to here is double, so you're two x in your money. So um, YouTubers won't tell you how to do that. I will tell you how to do it straight away, and it's free. So if you do appreciate that, please like. But yeah, I do think these emails are going to cross on the hourly. That's going to push us down to here. And if we get another failed breakout, this is so bad for Bitcoin because the bulls are trying really hard. You can see it yourself. The bulls are trying extremely hard. So wait, let me go into clean the chart for you guys. Oh, not that one. This is my thumbnail one. Um, let's take it to BTC USD. Let's go to this one. So as you can see, look, we're getting a double top, yeah, which everybody knows. And there's the neckline and we broke out of it, retested it, and now we're going to fall. This is really bad, okay? But what you can also see is if we zoom in slightly to here, that we've been falling and the bulls are having a lot of chance. Like we fell, the bulls are trying to break it. Get, regain momentum and take us back up to the top. Yeah, what happened? They failed. The EMA was there. They failed. We fell back down. We found support, double bottom, like I just showed you guys in the four hourly. Came back up, EMAs, and we just dropped. So, what happens if you keep falling? 
you're going to fall more. The support that you keep testing around here is not going to keep um, hold forever. The EMAs are now about to cross. I showed you guys what happened if the EMAs cross. Look, EMAs crossed here, dropped. EMAs crossed here, pumped. Yep, like this trend analysis that I show you guys is, is the best. You won't see any cleaner, simple trades and trend analysis, which actually makes sense. Cross, pump, cross, dump, okay? And like I said, it's honestly, it's, it couldn't get more clearer. Look at that. We're bouncing off these EMAs. We The balls have failed to regain momentum. That was their last chance. Yesterday was their last chance to actually break above because we've had so many bearish weeks. Look at this. Look how, look how bad this is. So we've got a new all-time high. Yeah. Let me just put something on there for you guys so you guys can see. Okay. There you go. Sorted. So look, we got a new all-time high here. We pumped up, and for the whole week, we fell below it. That is a very, very bad. That's a gravestone doji. What that means is price went really high, yeah, to its all-time high at 66,000, just under. And look, it closed really low below it. So that, that shows that price was coming down. That's why everyone was so bearish around that time. I don't want to do any changes I just want to zoom in to show you, make it more clear for you guys. What happened after that? Tried to pump, had a doji, pumped a bit, new all-time high, and we dropped. Because there's no, there was no momentum in the market. If you guys saw with the volume, like I don't use volume because it's, it's a very lagging indicator. It's, it's not accurate. It just fools everybody. So there's no point using volume in my opinion. But yeah, like you can draw this and you can see that like we're nowhere near to the actual trend, the channel itself. So if we're going to fall, we got a long way to fall, is what I'm trying to say to you guys. Let's touch the wicks. There we go. Like, look, look at the distance we have. Like, we pumped too fast. And what happened after a big pump? We fall twice as fast. That's always what happens in markets. And we got a big distance to go, yeah? Below 50k. If we do go below 50k, that is a very psychological um, period. And if we do fall below there, we will be falling a lot more. So I do think we'll get to about, if we get to about 42k, what the, what's happening? If we do get to about 42k, we will be um, seeing a massive bull run after that. Mark my words. But yeah, my current target would be, if we do break below those red lines, it would literally be about 51,000. That would be a nice target. If I put that on there for you guys as a... But you guys know that actually. But yeah, I want to say a big thank you to you guys watching. Be careful with Bitcoin. Don't put in these trades from here to just try and ride them up. I do because we have confluences on our actual charts. We have big confluences on our charts. Like look, these work. These these price points where I put trades in, they work. The sells, they work. The buys, they work. Everything works. Everything falls into play. We're in big profit now simply because we sold here. You need to wait for the market. Don't rush your trades. Wait for the market, okay? Big thank you for you guys watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.